I can overcomplicate things when it comes to cords, so let me simplify everything for you. This is a piece of my mesh, it's double strand construction. Without getting too technical, the way the knot rolls over the mesh with a double strand construction gives me different strengths and different performance capabilities. The lay engineer or the person in safety doesn't need to know all these things. What they need to know is that the manufacturer and the designer of the systems understand such things. When you look at a net, what you see is you just see a hole. Sometimes I laugh and say, really what we're selling is not a net, but we're selling the holes within the net because that's how you'd measure most things. But what's happening out in the industry is this is one of my competitor's nets. When it's new, it looks a lot like what I just showed you, which is my material. But this material has started with the woolly bear syndrome. I keep talking about woolly bear syndrome because it's critical that everybody on a job site understands it. When you're looking at a net, you need to know what you're looking at. This still probably to most people looks like a hole with a cord that's going in it, and they don't notice the fact that it's getting puffy. Some people may even think it looks heavier and it looks stronger, but the reality is what it is is degeneration within the netting material. For more information on woolly bear syndrome and how that impacts you in your job site, just visit netting.com. This is another educational session brought to you by netting.com. Stay safe. This segment is brought to you by 2.8 and netting.com. Stay safe. <laughs>